So now Thomas Giddens wants to go after the Dugong army. I'm reading a bunch of comments and there's so many people going after the Dugongs. I don't know what's going on. I think the fight with the cannibal duck starts something and now everyone's going after the Dugong. I don't know what it is. All I ask is that you don't become a cannibal Dugong, please. So you don't have a devil fruit. Which is fine, because the Dugongs are, like, strong, but they're not, like, unbeatable strong. You can definitely beat them. Uh, and you have Inurashi's IQ, which is, which is good. He is a very smart boy and a good boy. Definitely a good boy. And Bello Betty's strength, that's more than enough. I already feel confident that you're, you're gonna win this fight. And you have Rage Speed, yeah, you're, you're gonna win. I don't even think they have the Dugong on this filter. It'd be funny if they did. They should update it. Uh, and you have Diamante's durability, which it, I think is more than enough. Unless the Dugongs come back with like a massive power-up, which I would love. That'd be hilarious. And you have Doc Q's body, which is, well, eh, it's okay. That's not the best option you could have gotten, but it is what it is. But you have Marcos Hockey, so that's already plenty. Now, my question is, are you trying to destroy them, eat them, become their master? I, I don't know. And you have Yasop's combat skill, which, yeah, again, we already knew you were going to win. Now, depending on what your ultimate goal is here, I'd want a different outfit. But you got... Yeah. I mean, you won the fight, but at what cost? <laughs>